ओके सो आई फाइनली हैड एन अफ्रो बक्स टू एक्चुअली बाई द मेयर गेम पास सो आई वेंट टू द वर्ल्ड वेस्ट पेज वेंट टू द शॉप सेक्शन एंड ऑलमोस्ट बॉट द फायरट गेम पास फॉर सम रीजन एंड या आई एट लीस्ट हैड एन अफ ब्रेन सेल्स टू बाई द मेयर गेम पास But then after joining a random server I spawned at Bronze City and and was straight taken to Men and Scam for some reason. Yeah, they already think I'm too much mental to get the mayor game pass. You think I'm mental? You think I'm this much psychopath? Yeah, I'm the most kindest human alive. I never seek revenge. So yeah, after becoming the mayor I asked myself, what can I earn by doing this? But then I got an idea. Why not trade freedom for a Spitfire? Yeah, Spitfire. Every time someone gets arrested, I'm gonna do a trial and say freedom equals to Spitfire, so I can get a free Spitfire. To do that, I need to arrest someone firstly, because I don't think in this era people actually arrest people. So I went down to arrest this girl with her best friend too, because yeah, money is money. I I needed to arrest him too. So I hosted a trial about the girl. And right as I wanted to ask her, freedom for Spitfire, a random archer kill kill this random dude for some reason. I think he had too much of a big beard, so the archer got mad and killed him. But anyways, I asked the question, freedom equals to Spitfire. Sadly, she was too much poor, so I made her guilty and sent her to prison, of course. And then I server hopped and so acid rain in this server for some reason. The acid was too much powerful. Maybe that's the reason why Wildfish is dying compared to Westbound. In Westbound, there's no random acid rains in random servers I joined. So yeah, a lesson to be learned. Then I arrested this dude, but he was a faction monkey, so he left right as I arrested him. So I couldn't really do a trial. But I still hunted down his faction. They were at Fort Henry's, and the gate was repaired, so I couldn't really get in to arrest them. Yeah. But thankfully, I remembered I bought dynamite for some reason. Yes, I bought dynamite. But you know how much I had? Two. Yes, I had. I had two. I first used one to intimidate them, but then I used another dynamite to kill the Gatling gun spammer up there because I don't really want to die to a Gatling gun again. I tried to use my lasso to arrest another Gatling gunner, but I didn't really have enough skill to do that. So I went back to windmill to buy more dynamite. After the gate broke, I became tall, thinking it would make it easier for me to lasso them. But that was a bad idea because I don't really know how to aim while being tall. So I used my lasso to arrest this dude, but I missed. Then his whole faction came to kill me, so I had to kill one of their friends. Then that guy a volcanic spam me to death. But as you know, I'm a very kind-hearted dude. I have to forgive them. I was a very kind-hearted dude, so I must forgive them. But I randomly spawned at Outlaw's Perch, and I didn't really want to go to Bronze City to turn myself in. Like people are gonna ask, how did the mayor become wanted? Is he a psychopath? So I went back to kill everyone at Fort Henry because they caused this. They made me get a bounty. They made me angry. So I did my revenge. I killed all three of them at once. But sadly, they have enough IQ to respawn, so I had to kill them again. It was basically like a 6v1 because they respawned. But yeah, I'll let you enjoy the gameplay. As right as I thought, I've won. I've beaten them. I got my revenge. Two random guys came into my fort and tried. One guy tried to lasso me, and one guy peacekeeper spammed me. So uh, I had to take revenge again, and I had to kill both of them. As right as I thought, it ended. Another random guy came, which made me more angry. So I had to try hard on him. Then I saw one random sniper outside my fort trying to snipe me, but as I went there to kill him, I noticed it was too easy. He didn't even attack me. It was a trap. One guy was in front of me, Patterson spamming, and one guy was behind me, Volcano spamming. But I realized too late that was my mistake. I lost way too much health while doing this, so I had to kill both of them.
but sadly one random spammer came and finished the job. Am I too kind to forgive them? No, I, I went back to kill them again. Yes, don't expect me to be kind while they teabag me twice. And I know my voice is disturbing the gameplay, so so yeah, I won't even talk until I kill all of them and win this war. I use one dynamite to kill both of them at the same time. Which I will regret in a bit because they are gonna copy my technique, my trick. But anyways, two random guys came in but they sadly had to perish away. I used a overkill dynamite to kill that dude, give him an idea to copy my strategy, spam me dynamite next time around. And you know what they did, they, they randomly quick scoped me, so I had to quick scope them back for my ego purposes. But randomly another random guy appeared out of nowhere, I tried quick scoping him but I missed so I had to use my links and my try hardness abilities. And I finally captured the fort. But nope, psych! They copied my strategy and started spamming dynamite at my face. Of course, who could have known? As a kind individual, I went back to kill them, copying their own strategy that they copied from me, so I pretty much own this strategy. But yeah, enjoy this 3v1 gameplay. While almost clutching at 4v1 I think so, they respawned back to windmill and came here to kill me. Sad ending, I know. But it was the end game. It was time to finish this. I went back to the fort and started spamming dynamite, taking out kill them. But yeah, they copy it. I knew they are gonna just copy my strategy and spam me dynamite later words. So I didn't really want to spam all of my dynamite at once. Thankfully, I had enough aim and skill to kill all four of them at once. And yup, they started copying my strategy. One guy came and tried to dynamite spam me, but he doesn't really know how a dynamite works. He hold he hold it for way too long and exploded himself. And yeah, this was the final raid. If they manage to kill me right now, they win. If I manage to survive, I win. This was intense, so I'll let you watch for yourself who won. Everything has to come to an end. I took the glory. I took the victory. As my name goes, Victor, I won the war. But at what cost? I went from a chill mayor who'd forgive anyone to a psychopathic killer. Maybe that's the reason I went to Menon's camp in the first place. The game knew I was a psychopath who seeks revenge. So yeah, lesson of this video, always trade freedom for Spitfire and never seek revenge. Unless if you want to be good like me. See both of them.